In this lecture, I am going to solve for x and y of this linear equation. So let's see the answer. So first you are writing the given px plus q y equal to p minus q. So this is the first equation. Then after here qx minus p y that is equal to p plus q. So this is the second equation. Now the next is here you can see q y and this place here p y. So we can achieve the output of x and y if I equate this two equation of the y part. So you can also do with the x but equating with the y. So this here I am going to multiply with the p. So on equation going to multiply with the p and here this we can multiply with the q. So this is now pqy that become and this is here pqy. So writing here multiplying or uh, equation 1 with p and equation 2 with q. Okay, so let's do the multiplication. So here P multiplying, so this become P square X and this is now P Q Y and this here P square minus P Q. So P also multiply with that one. Now Q multiplying, so this is now Q square X and this is now P Q and here y this is your pq and q square so q multiplying with that terms so this is now pq and q square after that we need to add so this is the opposite part that has cancelled now the next is here that is now so there you can get here So this is here P S square X and Q S square X and this place. So this is Q P Q positive P Q negative that cancel. Now you can get here P S square Q S square. After that take the X common then you can get here P S square plus Q S square. And this is now P S square plus Q S square. Then X equal to here p square plus q square divided by p square plus q square so this is your value of uh, now opposite here numerator this is the same so that it cancel so x value that come here 1 x equal to 1 so this is the first answer now this x value you can put in any one equation so that I'm going to put inside equation 1. So here writing first we need to write the first putting. So here let's write there putting x value in equation 1. So what exactly is the equation 1? So this is now pq plus ky p minus q so here pq sorry px plus q y p plus q so this is the equation one so px plus q y p minus q is there okay px plus q y that is p minus q so here p minus q now the next is put the value x values x value is now here 1 so this is p into 1 and here q into y this is p minus q and after that p into 1 that is p and here q y p minus q now the next is here you can get q y and this p moving on the right so p minus q and here minus p so p p cancel 
then you can get here q y minus q so q q cancel one at a time then you can here write y equal to minus 1 so this is the value of y so x value is now 1 okay x value 1 and y equal to minus 1 so this is the answer of this questions so this is the way we can get the value of p and q of this equation so one time going to repeat so to eliminate here or uh, this part so we need to equate the uh, terms of uh, y so to eliminate y so here this one equation and second equation must be same so that i multiply on the no equation 1 with p and equation with 2 with q so after that you can get here pqy minus pqy so plus and minus that cancel and here you can get x so x value that come 1 and now you can put x value in 1 equation or 2 equation so then you can get the value of y so this is the way we can get the value of x and y of this equation so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.